Welcome back. Farmers and residents from Murgaon, Ponda and Bicholi Talukas have opposed underground gas pipeline project. They met Revenue Officer Anthony D'Souza expressing their displeasure over the double Bangalore pipeline. It will be plugged at Gokak to provide gas supply to Goa. The project is expected to be completed by 2012. The state administration, which is clearing way for the pipeline, has asked the farmers from Marmugao, Ponda and Bicholi Talukas not to allow any structure on their farms. This has forced people to oppose this project. What I have understood, uh, understood from the grievances of the public is that once the pipeline is laid, there will be a kind of a ban on development of land. And that particular width is 20 meters uh, in uh, length. So it is like a corridor of 20 meters that will be uh, used for uh, laying the pipeline. Deputy Collector Anthony D'Souza has said that the government has no plans of acquiring any land for the project. But after laying off the pipeline by GAIL, the land would be reverted back to the farmers. We don't have any intention of demolishing any dwelling house. We are not supposed to do that. If by error the houses have inadvertently come in the way of the pipeline, I will be recommending that diversion of the pipeline be done so that we do not encounter such kind of a problem while laying the pipeline. They have a right to object and we have to hear their objections. And thereafter, after hearing the objections, I have to examine whether there is a substance in the objection or not. Thereafter, obviously, I will be passing my orders on that and submitting my detailed report uh, to the central government in this respect. A principal correspondent, Murari Shetye, with video journalist Anil Sanadi for Prudent Media. West End Club is due to host Freedom Power Festival on 21st November. Mapsa police have submitted a report to the deputy collector of Mapsa mentioning not to grant permission for amplified sound license. There are cases registered against the club for violating Sound Pollution Act. Sajid Hussain, the member of West End Club, had applied for amplified sound license to Mapsa STM. But the STM asked the Mapsa police to furnish detailed report of the club. After a thorough inquiry, police submitted a report informing the cases of the club violating Sound Act and suggested not to grant amplified sound license for the club. Mr. Sajid Hussain requested for permission, sound, um, amplified sound license from 16 November to 30th November 2010 between 6 a.m. to 10 p.m. Yeah, he requested permission for entertainment show However, we have not recommended his permission since he is involved in number of crimes of violation of the sound. There are altogether five cases registered against West End Club. When we contacted Sajid Hussain regarding the festival, he informed that they have not received any permit for the festival from the SDM and they would organize IMC function in Doh. A reporter in Sangolda Loki Chilkar with video journalist Ravindra Darvi. A perfect example of communal harmony at Baina Vasco. Fishermen community celebrated Tulsi Chen Lagn and Ladain at Grand Zubay Island at Baina. Community believes that the Holy Cross and Tulsi protect them against all odds. Fisherman Devidas Kirap says, Navy should allot them some place to worship if they acquire this land. This island at Bayana is known as Grand Zue Island. It is also called as Mutt by some of the fishermen. They believe that the Holy Cross and the Tulshi protects fishermen against all type of calamities. They celebrated Tulshi Chalagna and Ladain on Thursday, a perfect example of communal harmony and bliss. <laughs> Muslim 
जो ये जो नाव आसा मुटकार बाप मुंडा में पहले सन मागी रात और विशेष जी देवला सा सांकुरी सा सा सांकुरी सा जब हम सगले सन पूजा करता सगले मेलो नाक्का एक कटा कोरा हम सगले पूजा करता दे हैव ओनली वन प्ली ना वी शुड अलाउ एंड अलॉट सम प्लेस फॉर देम टू वर्शिप इफ दे एक्वायर द ग्रेट जोए आइलैंड मेवी गेहूंग a reporter from Great Zoe Island, Surendra Madkaikar. News from Sports when we come back from a short break, stay tuned.